Today we're talking about mentors. What they are, why they're important, where you might be able to look for one. Let's dig in. A mentor is a person with expert boring. So what a mentor is, is someone that someone else can look up to, either for emotional support or even life skills or personal skills that can make that person looking up to the other person who they are. They feel like they can guide you through your life because they've experienced more than you have. My personal definition of a mentor is a person that offers you advice that not only helps you in your life, but advice that can change your life. Someone with experience, big deal. I'm already pretty good at stuff. Why would I even need a mentor? If you're a teenager, you know that growing up is horrible, especially if you have no one else to really be there and guide you. Oh, strike one. That's a pretty solid reason, but what if there's not a mentor for what I'm into? There's a ton of stuff. Anything you do not know how to do, you can find a mentor for. Oh, strike two. Cool, 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 cool. But has a mentor ever really helped anyone in the past? I've had a few different times in my life when a mentor would have made a lot of difference because I would have been going through something that I didn't know how to do. Someone who did. Uh, strike three. I am out of skepticism about this whole mentor thing. I'm also out of quarters. This isn't some jello mold type of sitch. There's not just one type of person that gets to be a mentor. There's no mold for this kind of thing. There's no directions. It turns out different every time. It's not always someone that's more experienced either. It could be a coach that roots you on. It could be someone that's just there in your corner when this tough stuff happens. It could be like a Jedi master teach you like some force stuff. Yeah, I don't know. It's not good to talk. A mentor could literally be anybody, a teacher, a neighbor, or it could just be someone who does the thing that you dream of doing. Mason will tell you all about it. Hit it, Mason. Lately, I've actually actually kind of become a mentor on my own. We just hired a new intern at the studio that I'm a manager at, and now I'm responsible for training him and showing him kind of the ropes of how our studio operates and a sense that would make me a mentor. And it's cool to look for someone that you feel is gonna make you better or they're doing something cool that you're into, but it's also important to find someone that you really feel comfortable with. And sometimes you actually don't have to go that far. One of my mentors, actually quite a few people, it's um all my friends. A lot of my friends I can go to and talk to them about anything it will be comfortable. We get it. It's scary to put yourself out there and it's intimidating to let someone in. But if you're doing it the right way, it's going to turn a wishy-washy path to your future into something a little more solid. <laughs> Doesn't matter if someone's younger or older, there's no age requirement to be a mentor for someone. I've gone out and found mentors. People who have made my path a little clearer, who've made my voice stronger. <laughs> There's people like that out there for you too. You just gotta go dig them up. No one has all the answers. Life is wild and it's unpredictable and that's what makes it kind of cool. Having a mentor can make things a little better. They can make the good times a little more good and they can make the bad times a little less bad. That's the truth. Thank you so much for watching. We always love people checking out the videos, seeing what they're into. You know, just kind of let them comment and watch. Hopefully you got something cool out of it. So if you really did like it, Subscribe to our channel and you get to see all of our cool stuff. You can actually click right here, just click it and uh, you'll subscribe. And then whenever we do something cool, you'll see it. So you just go.